Doug Glanville facing Jay Powell. Glanville was banging it all night. Pass First career five-hit game. He homered, he doubled, he singled three times. This was one of the singles scoring Alex Arias. Bottom nine, six, four, one on Ken Caminetti facing Wayne Gomes. Caminetti to short. Desi Relliford pumps. And then throws the ball away. Carl Everett scores. Caminetti hustles to second. Relliford, two errors in the game. He's got 12 for the year. Astros cut the lead to one. Bottom nine, throws, bases loaded, no outs. Paul Baco grounds to short. Relliford does handle this one, starting the 6-4-3 double play. Baco, an 0-for-5 night. Caminetti scored. He's also 2-for-4 with the homer. Speaking of homers, Mike Lieberthal, no homer. Hit him in again! Off the wall, Glanville scores from second. Lieberthal's 29th double of the year. He was two for five on the night. Phillies win it. Eight for three Rockies. Benny Agbayani. Call me Big Daddy when you back that thing up. First home run since June 25th, 160 at bats. Remember how he started his career earlier this season? Fourth quickest guy to 10 homers in the last 25 years. After battling through six Oral Hershey's, he's like, come on, Bobby, leave me in. Come on, man. leave me in. Bobby didn't. Bottom seven, Dennis Cook. Leaves with two runners on for Turk Window and Vinny Castilla. I was third grade baseball champ. My mama said I was pretty good. Vinny went two for four, got his 93rd RBI as Abbott scored to tie it at five. Top eight, former Rocky Daryl Hamilton. D. Hamilton was off the hinges. Larry Walker can't get it. Ventura comes home to score the go-ahead run. Hamilton has a triple. He said he was worried with Walker in right field. Quote, when I saw him going after it, I was like, oh, God, here we go again. Stop worrying, Daryl. You went two for two. You're hitting 316. And your new team beats your old team 10 to 5. Jose Cruz Jr. rips one to left. Ricky Lede runs it down. Worthy of another look. Lede would be all right, although shaken, and he'd be a factor later in the game. Bottom of the fourth, Jays up 2-1. Ex-Yankee Homer Bush with two on. Showing some pop. Taking one deep to center over Bernie Williams' head. Two-run score. 4-1 Blue Jays after four. Top of the fifth, Yanks put one on. 4-2, Ricky Lede with a man in scoring position. It's Chili Davis. Lede puts one in the gap, and he's running a long way. Fourth triple of the season. Joe Girardi would bring him home with a single to tie it at four, and Bernie Williams, holy cow, he is unbelievable. Two-run shot in the sixth, six, four Yankees. That's your score, bottom of the ninth. Carlos Delgado, who's already had a homer in the game, is buzzed by Mariano Rivera. And that will wrap it up. Rivera gets his 41st save despite walking the first battery face for the first time since July 9th, 19-3-2. Jason Veritek, two on, two out. Bartolo Colon gets him swinging. One of eight strikeouts for Colon. Bottom of the seventh, still 3-2 Boston. Two on, two outs for Roberto Alomar. Swinging. Martinez's 14th and final strikeout of the night. Went seven innings. In the eighth, Rich Garces on with two on and two out. Tyler Houston takes one the other way. Off the left field wall. Troy O'Leary plays it on a hop. Dave Roberts, Richie Sexton come on down. Indians take their first lead four to three. But the Red Sox tie it in the ninth. Send it to extras. Tied at four, top of the 11th. One on, two out. Jose Offerman, who's already homered in this game. It's one deep to left but it dies in the warning track. We're still tied at four, bottom of the 11th. Two on, two out for Omar Vizquel against Rod Beck. Vizquel hits one in the hole. Jeff Fry dives, fires, and gets his man. Rod Beck's all pumped up. As for Cleveland fans, this guy trying to make like Neil Peart, but Jason Veritek will provide a rush for Boston. In the top of the 12th, busts out the whooping stick for the 17th time this season. Trot Nixon would homer later in the inning. The Red Sox go on to win 6-4 in 13. So Pedro strikes out 14, gets the no decision. Base is full of pirates, and Chris Benson rips one down the right field line. Two come on down, two RBIs for Benson, two nothing pirates. Top of the six, Darren Holmes in a pitch for Reynoso against Aramis Ramirez. Hits one deep to center. Steve Finley can't run it down. Warren Morris, Brant Brown come on down. Ramirez with a triple, 5-1 Pirates. Bottom of the eighth, Benson still in the game and still going strong. Luis Gonzalez swinging. Benson went eight and a third, one run, four strikeouts. This Benson cleaning up. Maybe he could be governor one day.
Wins for the first time in seven starts and his 11 wins are the most by a Pirates rookie since Mike Dunn's third. Mirabelli, Mirabelli base hit, JT Snow rounds third. Here's the throw, here's the play at the plate. It's cut off. Snow safe at home, Giants up 3-2. Top of the ninth, it's 4-3 Giants. Marlins bringing Julio Ramirez to pinch run for Kevin Ory. Ramirez off and running and he's out. Giants hold on to win, 4-3. John Roscos with the throw. Third, 2-1 Dodgers against Expos Jeremy Powell. Eric Karras to right, Vladimir Guerrero, what a grab. Worthy of a much closer look. He did catch it, he even got, as you heard, Vince Scully caught off guard, so you know he must have really grabbed that one. Unbelievable grab, he also went. Uh, you ain't gotta go home, but you gotta get up out of here. Meliza, six and a third, five strikeouts, two earned runs. Bottom two, some serious LSU fans pulling for ex-LSU All-American Todd Walker. Come on, Todd. Come on, Todd. And Todd flies to left field. And serious, devoted. Oh, come on. Like, you could do better. Second inning. Oh, they're moving to better seats. Okay. Walker would recover. Go two for four. Top four. One zip. Roberto Kelly. Oh, Kelly was the bomb. One of two homers in the game. Fifth career multi-homer game. He said, it's funny. When you're just trying to put the ball in the bat, it goes a long way. Rangers up three zip. Two on for Rafael Palmeiro. Top seven. I, Papi, I did not know you could do it like that. 44th homer of the year, career high. 139 RBI for Palmero. He's five back of Manny Ramirez. Rangers win it 8-3. They beat the Twins for the 13th straight time. Bottom two, runner on first. Mike DeFelice, the grounder to second. David Bell to stop the throw. A-Rod, my bad, bro. A-Rod's 13th error of the year. Devore scored an unearned run to go up 2-1. And Rodriguez struggling at the plate as well. Flies out to Miguel Cairo. A-Rod went 0 for 5. He's stranded 4. Todd Williams brought on bottom 8 facing Jose Canseco, and he hits Jose in the left eye. Jose's like, dude, they just exercised my contract, man. <laughs> Easy on the pitch. Jim Edmonds, and Edmonds gets a dose of his own medicine here, Stewart. Carlos Beltran. All right, he's not diving with his back to the plate, which is where Edmonds did this catch in this stadium, but Beltran robs him. Top of the ninth, no score, two outs, but that scoreless tie should do be shattered by Darren Erstadt. First run of the game comes with two outs in the top of the ninth. It's the only run of the game. Erstadt's 11th home run of the season off of Lance Carter making his Major League debut. The defense of the Tribe. That's a slapper. What's with Travis Fryman? Missed it. That's an error. David Justice kind of coasted. Oh, boy. Falls. Jeter. Hustling. Beats the throw. Two errors on the play. Even more costly. The throw hit Robbie Alomar in the left wrist. He was forced to leave a bruised wrist status day to day. Next batter up is Paul O'Neill facing Dave Berber. And Dave Berber finds Paul O'Neill's happy place. A two run home run is 17th of the year. 2 nothing. Man. Spot him one. Hideki Arabu due for a good start. In trouble two on and facing Manny Ramirez. Gets out of it. What was Manny looking for there? Chased it. Next batter strikes out Jim Tomei. 8K, seven innings for Hideki. Bottom four now one on for Jim Tomei. Always dangerous. And Tomei locked in and out. We're tied at two with his 30th home run of the year. This one right into the tribe bullpen. To the top of the six, Yanks up by 1-3-2. The pinch hitter, Chili Davis, accepting the roll. Two on, Davis, team player. And Chili sends Opposite way, all muscle, field. off the wall for Chili. Tino Martinez and Posada would score on that, and the Yankees go on to win. With a victory, the Yanks open up a four-game lead on idle Boston in San Francisco. Obviously, too much wine tasting for that guy. Top four, Kirk Reader rocked. Mike Redman with a sample of serious length. That's his first home run in over a year. Reader has allowed a club leading 25 homers this year. Marlins are up 5-4, top six. Preston Wilson on third with one out. That's Garcia. The line out to Barry Bonds. Watch the arm of Bonds. He loves opportunities like this. The throw home. Wilson tagged out by Brent Main. No relation to Kenny, am I right? No relation to Al Newman either. Okay, bottom six, two on Armando Rios. To Garcia, the throw to Dave Berg. That's one out of Berg's throw. Awful. Jeff Kent would score, said Berg later. I lost my grip. It's my loss. We're tied at five. Same inning. Here comes your cousin again, Maine. Grounds to Garcia. Throws to Berg for one, but Berg is hit on his relay to first base, and his throw goes high. It was just a nightmare for Dave. Giants up one, and then top nine, Rob Nen. Maine do anything? No, not in that play. No relation to Rigaberg Bong Yong Song. Not at all. Ned with 
Falcons fourth inning. Dave Martinez is on first. Freddy Garcia against Bubba Trammell. Rips that thing. Charles Gibson. Fancy play. Gets the out at first. Take another look to see how Icelandic women 18 to 40 feel about it. The eighth inning, bases loaded for Alex Rodriguez. Wasn't going to play. Lou Pinello did play him because his mom went to the game. My sister is watching. That's why I'm on the show. A-Rod's mom nominated peak performer. Grand slam. Bottom of the inning, loaded up. Jose Mesa enters for the Mariners to Paul Sorrento. He's choking on a splinter after falling behind 3-0. Gets out of the inning. Sack fly. Pulls Tampa with the one. Fred McGriff against Mesa. 2-0 pitch. The Mariners win 5-3. Mesa ties the club record. His 33rd save of the season. And he protects Freddy Garcia's 15th win. Ortiz against Carlos Beltran. El es una grande hombre. His 21st of the season. 2 nothing Royals. And Beltran is going to get his name in the paper. We'll tell you why. Two batters later, Mike Sweeney taking it to right. Not out. Feed game. Jermaine Dye coming to score on the play. Royals go up three zip. Beat the angles 7-1. to Carlos Beltran.